down at ice level are the teams, and Ray Ferraro is there as well. We'll get his take on things shortly. March 17th, St. Patrick's Day. Much wearing of the green in the stands, and a terrific game we're anticipating. Face-off about to take place, but first, these words from Eddie Olchek. These two teams both need the W here tonight. I can see him playing it safe early, but the question is, which team will make the first mistake? Face-off number one gets us underway. The opening face-off has gotten us underway here. Winnipeg's looking to set things straight after their loss in the last game. The coaching staff has stressed the importance of playing within their system. Tremendous job done defensively there with a poke check. Winnipeg's along the wing at center ice. Gets back behind his own net. And freezes play for the whistle. Lots of green mixed in with the team colors in the stands today. St. Patrick's Day for thoughts on the game. Here's Ray. The key to this game is who's going to be able to move the puck out of their end the quickest. Both teams can forecheck really well. Many thanks, Ray. The Sharks with a face-off win. Steps across that line. Turned away with a stick. Great job on a cut pass. That is up close and personal. Both teams talked about having a physical presence. He got the message. That early hit sets the tone for his team. Chip to Besser. Off the woodwork, behold it. To the point it comes. Shoots. Outstanding point blank save. The goalie makes himself look big. The Sharks guilty of a minor penalty for using the stick blade. Just a hook. This was okay about 10 years ago. Not anymore. That's a hooking call. Winnipeg's initial attempt on the power play. Well, the power play guys have to go to work now. This is an opportunity they hope for. You want one early, and you want to see if you can get on the board first. Save. Trying for it. Wonderful save. It's out of the zone. to Hansen, and he's tripped and there'll be a penalty the Sharks get a two minute penalty for tripping oh this is clearly a tripping call he made no attempt to play the puck it took the legs out from the attacking player a two man advantage a terrific opportunity ahead one of the biggest problems on a five-on-three is teams are too caught. They don't shoot the puck enough, and they make it too easy for the penalty killers to kill it off. San Jose is in possession now as they move up the wing. They continue to work away. That's how you break up a play. With a hope and a prayer, he flops it to the opposite corner. And has been the case in the NHL for decades. When you do that, you have iced the puck. And so another face-off. The tie-up. He needed help, and he got it. No traction with that deep. He finally got it out of there. Couldn't get through. The Jets go back so that they can come back on this power play. Let's the shot fly. Blockered away. Shot. Outstanding save by the goalie. Hansen's face-washing him. You do that. You're going to dance with somebody. A little under three minutes have gone by. Both teams are still looking for their first strike. Winnipeg's got it. From the outside. Oh, he got it. You couldn't have chosen a better guy for that shot, or apparently a better guy to stop it. Carries it on in from center. Let's it go. Outstanding offense met by solid goaltending. Sends it back the other way. Setting it up. Throws it. Flashed out that glove. He throws that just for a break. Incredible nonstop action, Doc. Now we got a face off. San Jose's got a defensive zone win. 
Pucks loose off the enemy this time. The Sharks in their own end, ready an attack. He cleared that puck out of there. Oh, man, that's got to be a penalty. Pitching this one to Veselainen. The Sharks lose a man for two minutes for charging. Penalty to number 23, Sean Monahan. Two minutes for charging. Time of the penalty, three minutes, 39 seconds. The Jets go on the power play again. They have connected once already. They've already had some success on the power play with a power play goal earlier in the game. They don't have to change much. Make sure you move the puck quickly and get traffic to the front of the net. San Jose's two-minute minor is for shooting the puck over the glass. Enter that on the sheet. Delay of game. The Jets with a terrific opportunity. The power play is five against three. This five-on-three three power play has to be careful that they don't get lulled into a... Hit the post on the outside. Good job in clearing it out of his own end. Smart recovery by Hansen. Slid to Gerard. Gets it out. From his own end on the power play, it's taken by Hansen. With no time whatsoever, he turned it aside. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. A chance to clear. Perfect, Brister. Got that in the trapper. Critical win of the draw. Scooped up. Popped loose because of that hit. Tries to get it over the line. Clears the zone. Still time on this power play, but not much. Puck picked up by Hansen. Right on his stick from the left wing. Gives it over to the point. Winnipeg's power play not as good this time as before. Loose puck due to the play by Hansen. Good keep it. Score! And that is goal number 200 in his career. He's found a way to fill the net night in and night out, and he gets himself a big one here. 200 career goal. You want to score goals, you've got to get to this area of the ice. He doesn't even move. Once he drops into the butterfly, you're certain he's got the net covered. He just doesn't. Just a bit under six minutes have passed. Winnipeg's got the lead in this game, two to nothing. San Jose's won that faceoff and possession established. Could this be icing? And it will be based on the defense arriving first. 55 seconds. Puck dropped, and the winger stepped in to help. That's big. Karam pass to Nugent Hopkins. Has that one measured in his own end. Leads that charge into the zone. Let's it go. That was a great play and goal. Great opportunity. Better stop. Laid on to Hansen. Trying to go to Nugent Hopkins. Let's it go. Great glove save. San Jose is setting up an offense from the wing. Brister. Great stick there. And you thought open ice hitting was gone. This was part of their game plan. Be physical. And he gains the zone. Right to the point. Able to attack now. Wonderful chance was set up and the pass just goes wide. Fires. That's a great glove save.
just couldn't make it. Is that her off? That one is pointed to him. Not a good shot. And a coach once told me the video never lies. He's not going to like watching the video after that shot. That was way off. Scorches one. And off target with that one. And that one cleared by the penalty killers. San Jose skating in their own end. Trying to get to the neutral zone. Has it back deep. The Sharks are lugging it back through the defensive end. Right winged, Dusekov. Takes it in from the neutral zone. The Sharks' power play will reset. And he steps across the line. He throws it there and flashed out to turn that aside. I don't know that anybody sets career goals when they get into the league, guys, but 200 is a really nice number for him to achieve. Wonderful stop. The Sharks are skating it up in neutral ice. Takes a shot. Lightning in that glove. You know what, Doc? Instead of acting like this after the whistle, how about both teams play whistle to whistle like this? Okay, they win the draw. Shot. He saved it. Strong save. His perfect positioning allowed him to shut down that chance. Winnipeg's offense circles around one of the highest goal scorers in the league. While he can score off the rush, his most dangerous weapon is that quick release. The Jets shoot it back out. Got some time to check the clock and prepare to defend again. Trying to get something generated up the wing. Let's a shot go. Swept us off. And thrown down to Besser. Out to the half wall. And he gets it back. Point to point. Centering. Comes right off the boards. That puck came free. Could have been handled back. Feeds it in front. Bad save. And he cleared. Couldn't get it out. They keep that pressure turned up. Save with the pad. At the half boards. Takes the shot. What a reaction save. Equal to the challenge, nice stop. Let's it go, blocked. And on top of that, another great stop. Usually when you see shove it and push it after a whistle, it leads up to something bigger, and I mean a lot bigger. A little under seven minutes to go. Two goals have been scored, both by one team. Hanson's a wrecking ball on skates. He finishes everything at both ends of the ice. As a result, he is among the very top of the league in the number of hits delivered. They won that draw. Pass off the woodwork to Sekhoff. Puts one on. Oh, what a chance, what a save. That puck is held and the whistle stops playing. Off that face-off from the tie-up, the help came. Directing that one to Besser. Got that pass in his own end. And down to Monaghan. Gets that pass in the corner. Great opportunity, but the pass didn't connect. Centers. Terrific save with no reaction time whatsoever. That was a tougher stop than a look. Hansen's creativity has been on display most of the season as he has among the highest total points in the league. 
They lock up from the draw, and the teammate puts the grab on it. Winnipeg's continuing to probe up the wing. Offside is called, and so a neutral zone faceoff. That move not too slick there. Chip to Sekhoff. Can he beat him here? A great opportunity, but he missed the net. Sometimes that's what happens when you try to be too fine on a breakaway. You don't hit the net. Looking from the corner. Takes that pass from the other point. Perfect receipt of the pass. Good defensive read with that one. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. In with it now. Read that play in his own end. You're probably best not to make that type of play, even though you're trailing by a goal. Still make the right reads. Be aggressive when you can be aggressive. Walking a thin line near the border there. Puck loose. He couldn't get by. To Hansen. That puck's loose. Good defense. And he steps across the line. Gotten quickly back. Great take. Dangerous area. Taken up the middle. Skates it into the zone. Right in front. Save there. Perfect passing right through center. That one's deflected. The Jets in their own end lug that puck along. Takes that pass. A shot. Save. Picks it up back there. Shot. Great save at the edge of the crease. A timely save. That is tremendously tremendous. The Sharks with possession in the neutral zone. Got it at the point. Gets that one on a cross. And he missed it. Guarantee the goalie never saw it, but I know he heard it. That's how hard it was. Hammers one. Just missed the net with that one. The stop and holds for the whistle. First period has been played. An interesting start to all of this. Continuation in just a moment. The Jets have a 2-0 advantage. All right, fans, time for tonight's Lucky Road giveaway. Congratulations to Section 107. And the second period has gotten started. Any old check? Ray Ferraro, and I'm Mike Evans. Nicely into the zone. Stole that pass away in his own end. Grab that pass in the neutral zone. Shoots one. You can almost count that one, but no, what a save. The Sharks are lucky they're within a stone's throw of this game, Doc. Their goaltender has saved them so many times, they just can't skate with this team. The face-off, the tie-up, and a solid job from the winger there. And in flight over the line. Shoots one. Turned aside with a pad. A big one-timer. But ricocheted off the screen. The Jets have it along the side at mid ice Looking to Monaghan. Decides to head for the corner. Great speed bump set up there. 
terrific determination by Hansen. Took that pass right up the wing. A one timer off the mark. You give him time and space, and he's going to let that shot fly. That puck is free. Went off somebody. Crosses that line. Shoots. Big point blank save there. A quick developing play right in front. Almost looks like he's too close to the goaltender. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Winnipeg's moving the puck up the wing. It's dumped in. Lewis heads toward the neutral zone. Driving in from no man's land. Now it's directed to Legwan. Shoots! Great point blank save. Score! They'll take it. It went off a defender and in it counts. Low stick side used to be an area that you shot all the time, but now that the goaltenders are in the butterfly, it's not as easy to beat, but this one goes through them pretty quickly. Winnipeg's got a large lead in this game. Let's see if they can build on it or whether they'll start to get conservative. And the faceoff's won. Can start the attack going in the zone. And they score! They only trail by a pair. Well, Edsel, sometimes you just get so lucky. He's not shooting the puck there. Tenders fooled as the puck doesn't come with any velocity at all. A little over three minutes have elapsed here in the second. The Sharks have gotten back to within one. See if there's some momentum building here. Moving into Monaghan. Nicely received at the point. Side to side they go, trying to generate something. Great. Doesn't look like it's going to lead to much, but let's keep an eye on this pushing and shoving moving forward. The goalie's been the one key reason that his team's been able to hold on to this lead. He's faced a high percentage of top quality shots. He stopped virtually everything. On to Hansen. And he steps in. Feeds the point. He just fanned on. Play is halted, and we have yet another penalty call. The Sharks are going to the box for two minutes, and the call is tripping. I'm going to give credit to the puck carry here. He kept his legs moving. He forced the back checker to reach in and take him off his feet. The Jets get another power play. There is confidence here because they've been good. Let's see what happens this time. Three minutes, 45 seconds. Holds on and gets that whistle. Holden's made his defensive play and play away from the puck a priority to improvement. He's really shown some as he's among the highest plus-minus leaders in the league. Nugent Hopkins keeps his streak of face-offs going. Shoots one. Just couldn't find the target. Well, that's a good scoring chance. He's trying to be too fine, trying to pick the corner. Sometimes you've just got to shoot it at the middle of the net. Winnipeg's got two on this one for tripping. San Jose's power play has had many opportunities, just not much success. Maybe that'll change. No matter how often you work on the power play, the ones that struggle go back to the same basic tenets. And it's to simplify things. Get it to the point, shoot it, get traffic, retrieve it, shoot it again. Shoots one. The pad came in handy that time. The Jets lug that along in their own end. It's out of the zone. San Jose's going back to get restarted with their advantage. Using the point. Good place to shoot from. Save there. Oh, and the pass 
wouldn't go. Nicely into the zone. Let's it go. He missed the net. You find yourself in the slot with the puck on your stick. You better at least make the goalie make the save. Unfortunately, he shot that one well in. Outstanding save. Difficult opportunity. That great save was all positioning. Looking to get it out. Clears the zone. The power play unit has to recoil and try yet again. That puck is loose. No luck getting through that one. Good defensive play. Loose puck, though. Gotta ice it here. Good work in clearing it out. Gains that offensive line. Great save. He hangs on and gets the whistle. Pretty routine stop. You can see why everybody learns the butterfly when they're a young kid. Takes away the bottom of the net. Just a little under nine minutes gone. Winnipeg's continuing to build. They've got a three-goal lead. Pitching it to Besser. He's got that point pass. Passing one off now to Hansen. And he dumps it in. Pass attempt to hold it. Puck is thrown to Besser. Let's it go. Routine save. He's got it there. He wants to clear it out. And that's a good job taking the pressure off. Snapping a pass to hold it. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Winnipeg's winging it at neutralize. Breakaway. What a big breakaway stop. Pitching this one to Monaghan. Trying to go to Besser. And he gains the zone. And a save. Brings it low off the post. Close in play. Strong wrister. Terrific grab with the glove. And so a player change coming up for the Jets. The Jets have killed off a long penalty. This ought to inspire them to go the other way. Brings it in for an attack. Slid to Monaghan. Shoots. Oh, that was close. When the puck sounds hard, when it hits the end boards, that means you've missed the net. Scoring chances handed away. Around through the corner right now. Directing that one to Gerard. Breakout pass into empty ice. Bumped off. Has it in his own end. Let's it go. May not have intended it, but it hit him. Picks it up in his own end. Trying hard to get it out of the zone. Oh, that's a good keep. That's a great keep at the line. Gains the zone. Fires. Save. Freezes play. A little under eight minutes to go in the second. So the scoring of that goal makes this a three-goal lead. Can they make it four? Or will the pressure wilt them? A one-timer! The lane was jammed, and it hit somebody. Lutstad's ailing, but he can't get off the ice. He's going to have to try and finish the shift. Looking to Anderson. It's dumped in. Puck's loose, denied by the roadblock. Steps in from the neutral zone. Shoots one. Just missed the net. He was hoping for a little bit more with that chance, but his shot is just off the target. Tremendous hit. I wonder if that hit will change the momentum of this game. Takes that pass at center ice. 
skill play by Anderson. Laid on to Hansen. He helps his team make progress with that bounce pass. Intercepted by Anderson. He's got it. Winnipeg's organizing things back in the defensive zone. He is able to move on in. Oh, that was a bad pass. Okay, back out we go. Let's see what happens here. Chipped off the boards and ahead. Tries to get it on net. Wonderful stop. Bukestad's laid it all out on the line. He was injured earlier in the shift. Still had enough jam to get out and block the shot. Got it in his own end. Outstanding body contact. Hansen's play with the puck is known throughout the league, but when he lays the body on, everybody waits up. Puck ends up out of the zone, so they must recoil. San Jose's moving the puck in the defensive zone. Somebody got in early, and so offside is called. You can't run around looking for big hits like this. These come right into your lap. Over four minutes still showing on the clock this period. The Jets have built on their earlier two-goal lead. Their advantage is now three. It's a face-off win. May not seem important in that territory, but they have possession. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Winnipeg's along the wing at center ice. Shoots. What a save. If you want to score goals, you have to go to this area. Starts a breakout by passing ahead of the play. Gathered up again by Hansen. He gets that pass ahead in stride. Reads the play and keeps it. Well, a little bit of a sloppy turnover, Doc, but that looks like a guy just trying to make too much happen. He wants to get his team back in the game. Shoots. May not have been intentional, but he got it anyway. Receives that pass from the other side. Whoa, what a play. What a terrific opportunity. Outstanding save with the glove. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. through can't retain possession save there and decides to just hold on and get a stoppage of play another good job in the face-off circle one of many today what a percentage he's got gives it on a cross from the point players tired about to get a rest but still seconds to play in this period Right into the slot. Oh, my, what a save. Great cut. San Jose's won that faceoff. They have it. Buck loose now picked up. The Jets with a neutral zone possession along the wing. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. A backhand shot. That went off the pad. The Sharks wheel it up the wing. Gives it to the point. Around through the corner. 
That puck went loose off the enemy. Not much time left. Time for maybe one more rush. Puck picked up by Hansen. Takes a shot. Oh, lightning quick and a terrific save. And yet another save. How does he do that? Forty minutes have been played. Some hits given, some shots fired. But let's see what they have in mind as we get closer to the start of the third period and crunch time. As is our custom, we look now at the shots on goal. Wow, does anybody play defense here? 33 for the Jets and 32 for the Sharks. Hey fans, now is the time to pick up your team calendars. You can pick them up at Kiosk 144 on the lower level. San Jose's lineup could be shaken up. We're not sure right now. There was an injury on this play. Will this guy return, and will he be okay? We'll find out, but first, these words. Forty minutes down, at least twenty minutes to go. What are your thoughts so far? The Sharks are down on the scoreboard, Doc, and they know they have a real hot goaltender at the other end. Pretty simple formula. More people, more pucks to the net. Eventually, you might get a bounce, and you'll be right back in this game. And he dumps it in. And they've got it again. To Hansen. Steps across that line. Propel to Veselainen. Great save. Now it's directed to Holden. Moving it to Besser. A long lead pass to Holden. Handled with the stick. The Jets skated up on the side. Taken over again. But Luce couldn't get through. And they are in. in front using the point he's got it and the pickup the Sharks wheel one ahead up the wing a good stick oh look at this he's alone can they catch him Puck grab what's next got it on his stick in the slot terrific save with no reaction time whatsoever not a lot of room to score from in that area. Great save. Shot on. And flashed out to turn that aside. Back to the point. Takes a perfect pass. Well, that's what your wings are for. They give it to you right in the center. Turned on net. He scores! That's two on goals boy I love how he put himself in a position to really get a lot on that shot where was the defensive zone coverage there I don't know Edzo how he could do much more than that the shooters got all kinds of room to put it in the goaltender never gives up on the play but it's in the back of the cage Winnipeg's goal has staked them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. A face-off win. Let's see what develops. It's dumped in. It remains in the zone. Fantastic shutdown. generate something great job in his own end with that interception he's got that one measured in the attacking zone carries it on in from center right near the line can he keep it going and a save pitching it to Besser chip to Monaghan on the holder 
nice cut. Winnipeg's looking to head man up the wing. That pass along the boards. Shoots. Great save at the edge of the crease. Wow, with this puck being so close to that, this is all a reactionary save. A little under four minutes half past. One step short of a fistful. It's a four goal lead. From a slot wrister, save. Leads that charge into the zone. At the front of the net. Deflected off the blocker. Thrown to the slot. Fired at the net. Oh, close call there. That was a decent chance, but he just missed the net. Padded away with authority. Padded away. Dominance right now. Swung back to the point. And ring more bells on that one. One after another. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Beside the line. Fires got in front of another one. You gotta think that's a game-changing save there. Collect it now. The Jets leave their own end. Pop loose, couldn't get through. Carrying it in center ice. Piked in the slot. Loud pad save. What a heavy collision along the boards. He finishes his check here and drives his man right into the boards. Takes that pass from the other point man. In the slot. Slides it to the point. Didn't handle it very well. Free pop. Great poke check. The point now for the one timer. He scores! Slowing the momentum. With all that pressure in the zone, you just knew it was coming. What a shift. Almost an impossible shot to stop. I don't know if this puck could be placed any more perfectly up over the glove. Winnipeg's come up big on another face-off. Dogged determination there by Hansen. Nice stick by the defense. Passing one off now to Holden. Cut that pass in his own end. I guess that's a mistake with the puck as he turns it over, but he's just trying to make something happen. Maybe a little too aggressive there. What a tremendous hit. Good intercept in his own end with it now on the outside a shot oh he got it you couldn't have chosen a better guy for that shot or apparently a better guy to stop it the Jets are at the wing in neutral ice he's got that pass at the point that puck struck him in front blocked away Accepts that pass. Maybe he can generate something. Slid to Besser. You could almost count that one, but no. Skates it into the zone. A shot. That puck hit him on the way to the net. Took that away in his own zone. And he dumps it in. Oh, look at this. He takes that point pass with a shot. Just missed the net with that one. From that position on the ice, he's got to hit the net. Make the goalie make a save. Makes that play deep. It's dumped in. The Jets recoiling back in their own end. Crosses that line. Sends to the point. 
back in his defensive end to get it. A shot. Stick to some. That puck winds up underneath him, and so play is stopped. Good face-off win. Shoots one. Winnipeg's in the neutral zone along the wing. Let's it go. Blocker it away. Takes it right back. It's an onside play. Important interception there. the game. When you get to this area of the ice, you got to get rid of that puck quickly, and he did. A lot of times, as soon as the guy goes to shoot the puck, the goaltender drops into the butterfly position. He thinks he's got the net covered. Turns out he doesn't. Charles Goalie to the Goldberg bench. Substitution made. One. It's going to be a long rest of the night for him as he'll slowly make his way to the bench and exchange his mask for a baseball hat. His night is done, and it hasn't been a very good one. Winnipeg's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period for the opposition at least that is fortunate. And they've taken that face off between the blue lines and won it. Nice work by Hansen. The Jets are moving the puck in their own end. Sekhatch is headed to neutral ice. To Gerard. The Sharks aren't going to like this game any better when they watch it on video as well. This is a bad movie that they're going to get to see again as the coaches break down the tape. Pass attempt to Hansen. Picked up in the attacking zone. Wonderful stop. Winnipeg's in possession and moving up the wing. Stood up there. Couldn't get through. It's loose. That went off someone. Loose puck. Puck is thrown to Gerard. Laid on the holder. Brings a shot. Outstanding save. What one word of advice when you're pushing and shoving like that, you better be ready to drop the gloves. Just over nine minutes left to go in the third. A highly offensive game, at least for one team. My oh my, what offense we're seeing by one. Use that big goalie stick well. Never satisfied. Never take your foot off the gas pedal. He's got two goals now. He'd better be thinking about getting number three. The Sharks shifting gears back in their own end. Smart recovery by Legwand. Puck heads to the neutral zone. The attackers, of course, follow and he dumps it in. Good intercept. Snapping a pass to Hansen. Cut off that pass at center ice. He gains the zone. Oh, broke it up. Pitching this one to Hansen. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. Looking to make something happen from behind. Banked right ahead. Very important steal for him. Well, I can see what he's trying to do there, guys. He wants to make a play to try and turn this game back around. They're trailing, but he forces the puck in, and he turns it over. The Sharks have been handed a minor penalty for tripping. Sharks penalty to number 18. Two minutes for tripping. Time of the penalty. 13 minutes, 36 seconds. You can just see the confidence when a team is lightning-like on the power play, and this one is. They get another chance beginning now. 
The Sharks lucked that along up the wing. Pushing it on in their own end. He banked it right ahead. That's somebody that's been around. He took a quick look up the middle of the ice. Nothing there, so he banks it off the boards to his partner, and out of the zone they go. He stood in the lane and blocked it. Kicked away. They keep that pressure turned up. Recollected. It's dumped in. The Jets get the puck with just a few seconds left on their power play. Gains the blue line. San Jose's in possession as they travel in the defensive zone. And he dumps it in. Stood him right up. Trying to go to Nugent Hopkins. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. That puck is loose on a good defensive play. Oh, how can they miss that pass? Winnipeg's power play unit fails this time. They've been okay so far. Big drive! He missed the net! Oh, that shot exploded off the stick. Just over the net. Not a long pass, but effective. He's got it. Save there. Good grab again. Up to the point. Fires. He scores! Right from the top, iron down! A snapshot is between a slap shot and a wrist shot. And that is textbook snapshot hockey. He finds the back of the net. The Sharks have gotten one, but they still trail by an enormous score. Let's see if they can work on their flow, get their offense going, and maybe get a couple more to be more respectful. Turned away with the stick. Play stopped. That puck is just held. The Jets do an excellent job limiting their opponent's shots on net. One of the main reasons is how many shots they block. Over the last few games, it's a crazy number. Winnipeg's looking to head man up the wing. Carries it toward the woodwork. Linesman signals an offside. San Jose's got that neutral zone faceoff. Propelled to Monaghan. Really good cut of the pass. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. San Jose's along the wing at center ice. Into the end of attack. Let's it go. Great stick save. San Jose is looking to head man up the wing. Decides he wants the corner. Is able to step behind the cage. Stared him down and made the save. The goaltender shuts that one down and a superb opportunity. That's good. He canceled out that icing. Tried, but it didn't work. And so the final minute of the third and the tilt. This will all be done soon. Fox loose went off some terrific determination by Legwalk. Oh, what a hit! And there is a cut, and so the fight begins. Now that's the sign of a true teammate. Here they go, guys. This is as much about the next game as it is about this one. The players starting to look ahead and set the tone for the rematch as it's not that far away. are down on the ice and this fight has ended. I think both these players, Doc, realize this fight was coming to an end, so they just grabbed on to one another. Really not much to be determined yet. This game's a blowout.
So we're into the last minute. All is academic here. Terrific challenge. Outstanding save. You talk about cutting down the angle. Perfectly executed by the goaltender. Save. He can start some danger here. San Jose is moving the puck up the wing. And he picks it up. Gets in, and he'll look over his options. Wonderful save. What a skill level there. Pat it away. Puck picked up here. Nice tip of the pass. The Jets with possession up the wing. Oh, off target. And the horn. And the St. Patrick's Day game has ended. Struck me that one goaltender, at least, had a lot of four-leaf clovers in that glove. And so on St. Patty's Day, where there was lots flowing in the rink, including some frozen water on which they skated for three periods and perhaps more, uh, if you count the warm-up. It was a good time to be had by all here. We hope you enjoyed it. We sure did. For Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying good evening from this place.